Andrews, if you've been outside today, you've noticed it is cold. Our WTOL 11 weather team actually just issued an alert day for tomorrow. And right now, Toledo Public and Washington Local are both closed tomorrow. Springfield is on a two hour delay. So how long is this cold going to stick around? Chief Meteorologist Chris Vickers joins us now. And Chris, so we'll be bundling up for a while, right? Well, quite some time. Most of this week, it's going to be bitterly cold. And a lot of that going to focus on Tuesday morning. After that, the impacts of some light snow and blowing snow that are going to come into the area tonight. It is going to be a very tricky morning for travel across the area. So we want to extend that caution right now so you're prepared for this one. Morning snow, then blowing snow into the afternoon with bitter cold temperatures that are set to return that will likely keep us below zero. But that feels like much of the day. The highs only get expected to be around eight degrees as we go into the afternoon on your Tuesday. A morning snow, blowing snow to the afternoon, close to 20 late Wednesday and into Thursday, lower 20s will be expected. Let's take a look at the uh, Doppler radar. We do have dry conditions across the area, but it's been a bitterly cold feel. Single digits to right around 10 degrees for the majority of the area, and it's got quite the brisk chill with the wind still gusting up there around 15 to 20 miles per hour, and current wind gusts in some areas have really Really made it feel sub zero much of the day. So where do we go forward? We've got snow that comes into the area. It's overnight tonight. I expect we'll be dry through midnight, but those wind chills will be sub zero parts of the area under wind chill advisories, especially along and west of I 75, where we're likely to be double digits below zero. It could be as cold as 15 to 20 below zero, especially as we go into Tuesday morning. Light snow comes in after midnight. This is going to time out through about 8 a.m. Some light snow showers. It's not going to be much. I'm talking a half an inch to an inch. Some areas up to an inch and a half of total light, fluffy snow. But that's in conjunction with the cold air. Really going to be a tough feel to start your Tuesday. Those wind chills going to be double digits below zero. Coldest of the wind chills. Those are likely to be west of Toledo, where we're going to be as cold as 20 below zero. It is going to stay very cold and breezy through Tuesday afternoon, and that's when the blowing of any of that light fluffy snow will continue through Tuesday afternoon. How much snow to expect? Not going to be a ton of snow. Most areas going to be around an inch, but it's going to be very fluffy light snow, which is very apt to blow around in some of those winds that will pick up through Tuesday afternoon. So overnight tonight, some snow showers, wind chills of 10 to 20 below zero. Those snow showers coming after midnight a low down around two degrees and our alert day Tuesday is going to be for that frigid cold morning snow and afternoon blowing snow with winds that make us up to about 25 miles per hour. We've got our alert day for Tuesday. That snow chance is going to be with us mainly in the morning. Single digit highs into the afternoon close to 20 as we get into Wednesday. Low 20s for Thursday and Friday and eyes toward another clipper system. It comes in late Thursday into Friday could bring additional snow accumulations and a gradual warming trend really beyond this weekend. It's next week takes us back into the 30s. Highs close to 40 toward the end of that 10 day forecast.